If you ever want to get anything from the Fortnite item shop, please use It's Me Sam 15, all caps. Thank you. Okay, so welcome to episode one of my new Minecraft series, which I'm going to be doing. Uh, I've just loaded into a brand new world. As you can see, it's a pretty open area, which I don't know if that's going to be a good thing. But yeah, I hope you enjoy the new Minecraft series. Okay, so I'm just starting off getting some wood. I'm just going to make a crafting table, and of course that allows me to do anything else. And I also need to get some food, because I've just left it on normal difficulty, so I'm going to need to eat, get that meat in me. That sounds dodgy. Uh, yeah. Let's kill some cows, get some food. Annoyingly, this isn't a normal oak wood. This is like, uh, I don't know what it is, spruce maybe? I don't even know. I don't know if I'm happy with the location either, to be fair. I think it could have been a bit better than this, but... I'll explore, see what I can find. Hopefully, a village maybe. That'd be helpful because then we just sort of stay there for a while. But, oh, normal, normal grassland. Yes, this is what I want. I upgraded to an axe, so I should be able to get some wood a bit quicker now. I also made a pickaxe because I need a furnace to cook my food because my food's already going down. It goes down so quick, and I, I don't really know why it goes down so quick, but can I reach that? No. There is some coal over there, so yeah, I think this is a nice spot. I'm going to get some stone, make a furnace, cook some food with that coal. Looking like it's going to be a good little world, I hope anyway cook up some of our food, I'll just use some wood for now because I need to get some more stone to make a stone pickaxe and I can go mine the coal, get that a bit quicker my food is literally going down so goddamn quick and it's proper annoying that it goes down so quick but uh, I need to make some stick make some more wood, make some stick make a stone pickaxe, it's, it's quite easy to be fair to just sort of get ahead uh, well not get ahead but do stuff quite quickly on this game which is quite nice more grassland I think we have actually got a nice spot here I'm very happy with, with the location we have chosen to build our house in okay so we've got some of that good good cooked meat so that is helpful I do want to uh, get more wood actually I need to get more of everything to be fair it's a bit annoying that this is like spruce or whatever but It'll be alright. It might look it might look nice. We shall see. I mean there's normal wood next to us, I don't know why. I wasn't just gonna get this. It's much easier and of course it looks a lot nicer. So I'm gonna get some of this and hopefully we can start building a house soon because it's gonna be night very, very soon and I don't have a bed yet. So I need to find some sheep. I need to I need to find a lot of stuff. But I think we've I think I think we're on to a good start. So that is very, very nice. What I'm actually going to do is I'm just going to live in the cave for now. Just so then I've got uh, just a bit of protection from the mobs. Because of course they're all out right now. So we should be a bit more protected in here. And we could start getting some more cobble. And hopefully start making the house when it's daylight. I can't really find any sheep anywhere. Which is slightly annoying. There is an enderman out here somewhere as well. I don't know where he's gone. There's a creeper down there. But we got a nice, nice little setup coming in here. The food's all cooking, so we're looking very really good on food already. To be fair, looking very, very good right now. Right, I'm gonna go out and get some wood. I've made some stone tools, so we have upgraded. We should now be able to, of course, get stuff a lot quicker. I am really happy, to be fair, with the location that we are. I think we've got quite lucky with the amount we have around us. All the mountains. Skeleton over there. I'm gonna not go near him. And we've also got water there. I mean, I can get up there now, I guess. But yeah, I'm I'm very happy with 
the location that we have spawned in. Right, yeah, uh, I just said about the location. I have just been uh, hit by a creeper. As you can see, there is the other one. Go away, creeper. Go away. No. Don't blow up on me. No. Right, one more hit. You should die. Yes, thank you. Got some gunpowder. Need to eat. Jeez. I didn't even know the creeper was there. I literally didn't hear it at all. That was It just blew up. As you can see, this is where he blew up. <laughs> Luckily, though, I survived. And I also have meat or food to get me back up, so that was lucky. Okay, so I've just been out smacking some trees. Uh, I now have a good amount of different types of wood, normal oak wood and birch, so... But I use the birch for the floor, because I sort of got a plan of sort of what I'm going to do, because of course you plan ahead. Um, so this cave uh, will not be my house, hopefully, tomorrow. These are literally just spawned in, because they were not there. <laughs> When I uh, no. walk past a second ago, got a, whatever this zombie thing is, uh, I don't even know what are these called. I don't even know. Ah, skeleton! I'm not fighting that. Uh, get out of here! This is the hole. With the creeper! Oh my god, he literally followed me up. No, go away, skeleton! Go away! Die! Thank you. Okay, so it's it's day now. Well, morning. So, I think I'm going to start the production of the house. Okay, so I've got the, the main framework of the the house. Of course, I'll build it up to a couple levels, but I'm hoping that it should look quite nice. I hope, at least. So, I shall catch you guys up once I've done a bit more on this house. Hopefully, it will look nice. I hope so. Okay, so as you can see, uh, I changed up the house because the other one was just going to be too dark and I don't think it would have looked very nice. So I'm changing it up, making it look a lot nicer, I think. I need to get sand for windows as well. But the house is coming along quite well. Luckily, there was a bit of uh, sand next to me. What is I Right, what has that done to me? Why is she throwing potions at me? Have I been poisoned? I don't even know. Bloody witch, go away. Uh, am I going to die? I, I actually have no idea. I'm assuming I'm going to survive, maybe? I hope so. I actually have no clue if I'm going to die from this or whatever. Oh, she dropped stuff that I just didn't pick up. Okay, I survived. Uh, don't need an egg, don't need that. Rotten flesh, don't need. Uh, birch sapling, I don't need. Right, what did she drop? I'm assuming this is just like empty bottles and, and stuff like that. Uh, what is this? Glowstone dust, potion of healing. I mean, that's quite good. I, I'm assuming. Guess that's good to have. I'm gonna bring my furnace and my crafting table inside into my house with no roof andesite, which I absolutely hate on this game. I just I don't understand the point of andesite. I, if anyone can tell me what it actually does, <laughs> then I'd appreciate that. But every time I get it. I shall not be using it. I hope not anyway. Right, uh, let's place my crafting table and my furnace. Let's get these in. Uh, I'll just over here for now. Okay, I'm going to wipe my coal back in there. Right, uh, actually I need to smelt the sand, make some glass. Okay, we're, we're, we're on the right track. The weather's not, but we are, so that is good. Okay, so I've got some glass panes, I'll have windows now. We're really going up in the world. Right, and I've wasted one, of course. How can I go without doing that? Okay, so right, we have windows. Now I need to actually get started on having a roof because this isn't very helpful not having a roof. Okay, so now we have actual spruce floor. I don't know why I'm still cooking glass. I don't need any of this. But I'm just going to... Actually, no, I should probably stop that because I'm wasting all my uh, coal. I should probably cook some more food. But look at the house. I, uh, it's coming along really nice now. I will put a roof on it eventually, uh, and that should make it look even nicer. Okay, so we actually have a roof now, so we can go in and actually be half safe, I guess. Let's break that. So, yeah, it's coming along quite nice. I'm actually going to brighten it up. I'm just going to whack a, whack a torch on there. Ah, oh, it's about two there. One there, and that's brightened this up a bit. Need to make a bed uh, right there. This bed is going to go. 
I don't even know the best place to put my bed. Just gonna put it whack it there. Why not? Go sleep. And then see what to do next. I think there's still a bit more work I can do on the house, make it look a bit nicer. This storm is just mad. Oh my god. Right. I did not know that was happening. Okay. I'm gonna go try find my loot. Just remembered I was in the house. Luckily I slept. So my loot is right out here. That was not what I was expecting. I didn't even think that a creeper could be outside my house. Luckily it didn't destroy any of my house. But, I mean, that was still a pretty close call. Grab all my stuff. I mean, there is a cave beneath us. With some coal. <laughs> um, yeah, right. Well, that happened. Didn't. I, I don't even know what to say. I was not expecting that. Now I need to replace all that as well. Uh, and it's going to be like horrible like this for ages as well. Until the grass grows over it. Which is going to be really annoying. But that was pretty terrifying. Luckily, though, it didn't do anything to the house. So that was good. <laughs> right, I need to whack all the loads of this crap in the chest. Loads of stuff I'm not going to use. Uh, pretty keep that stick, actually. Glass, I don't need sand. Glass and dust, I'm going to put all this in there in case I do die somewhere. Because that would be rough. Uh, that food should be cooked. I'll whack in some more. Whack the, rotten, whack the rotten flesh in there. Yeah, that was uh, pretty terrifying though, that creeper. Oh, hello skeleton. They, I'm pretty sure they have like auto-aim as well. So if he was to shoot, it would hit me, even if I was moving around loads. They can't miss. But I think this is a good time to end the first episode of this. I'm sorry it hasn't been the most exciting. But we've got a base now. We've got a house that we can call home, I guess. So that's good. And we've got just a nice area. I'm happy with the area and how this is all going. So, if you did enjoy the video, please do like and subscribe. And I hope you stay around for the next one. And goodbye.